So Tommy, you've seen the inbox and all those questions we are getting about water stains, whether they be on uh, the drywall that's on the wall or the ceilings. It seems like a lot of people have them. You sure do, and they got to fix the problem first. So, I mean, it can come from anywhere, right? I mean, our roofs can leak, we can have ice dams, we can have driving rain, plumbing fixtures, it doesn't matter. Exactly. It causes a mess. Exactly, and it causes a stain, a rust color stain. And that rust color stain could be from iron in the water, it could be from the tannic acids in the wood. Mm -hmm. So, you've got to look at the severity of the problem, first of all. If you've got a lot of drywall that's crumbling, then you've got a problem and you've got to think about mold. Okay. All right. So the first thing you want to do is mix up a solution of bleach and water, about 50-50, and figure out a way on you how you're going to get it on there, whether or not you're going to put it in a spray bottle and mist it, or whether you're going to dab it with some gloves and, and a sponge. But any way you look at it, you want to protect the area and yourself when you're working with bleach. And you want to make sure that we kill the mold and mildew before we move forward. So let's say that we have stopped the leak um, and we don't have mold or mildew to contend with. It's gone or we never had it. Uh, everything is dry. Mm -hmm. What are we doing now? Are we patching or are we just painting over? If the drywall isn't bad, you can scrape it clean and then prime it because if you don't prime it, that tannic acid stain will come through the painted surface. What are we priming it with? You're going to prime it with either an oil-based primer or a shellac-based primer because that will seal it so they can't bleed through. Oh, interesting. So this is actually sealing that, stopping it from exactly. continuing because exactly. sometimes they do just come back. They will always bleed through the paint if you just paint it with a latex or an acrylic paint. So special primer and then on top of that, a regular paint. A regular paint, you can paint the whole ceiling. Unfortunately, you probably will have to paint the whole ceiling or the wall because you won't be able to match the paint. Paint it with uh, the shellac primer? No, and no. No, no just, just prime the area with the stain with the shellac base to get rid of that tannic gotcha. color. And then paint your whole ceiling with an acrylic or a water-based paint. All right, good information. Thank you. All right. Here, get to it. Oh, thanks. <laughs>